so you were rapping maybe and scratching working at red lobster then you saw eddie at <laughs> wait, radio wait, city red lobster i saw delirious it was like oh okay that's what i should be doing uh what the Radio City story is basically me online. It's like one of those things. My father's got the paper. We're the only people on the block with the New York Times. And it's a big full page ad. Eddie Murphy's going to be playing Radio City. Ooh, tickets go on sale tomorrow. Okay, I'll get there at 11 o'clock and buy some tickets. This is back. You know, yeah, pre no, it's prehistoric times where you have to go to a place to <laughs> buy a it's ticket. It's prehistoric times. So. The line was six city blocks long. Oh my god! It's the longest line you've ever seen in your life. It was. It was like. It was like one of those depression lines. <laughs> <Yes>. Bread line. <laughs> right for bread. Yeah. Yeah, like the, Like one of those depression lines. Like Eddie Murphy is going to be in a building. Yeah. In six months. You know. <laughs> Anyway, I'm yes, I'll wait. I'll wait, <laughs> and I get online, and I'm just reading my paper, and I'm like, hmm. Comic strip. Hmm. Audition night. Hmm. Maybe I should go there. And I left line and walked from Radio City to the comic strip. Audition night was not that night. They sent me to catch. I went to catch. There was about 40 people outside waiting to pick a number of one of seven numbers. You pick a number, and if you, you know, you pick one of those seven numbers, you get to perform that night. I got number seven. Ooh. Uh, I'd never performed, ever. Had you thought of shit to maybe? I was thinking of shit online. <laughs> while I was on the line. Do you mean in, in the line? In the line. I'm in like, Back online. in the this 80s, is the online meant you were in a oh, line. I was God on the it, line. I was confused. And, um, by the way, I, of the 40 people, maybe 30 of them had already auditioned before, and it was just yeah. a normal thing. Like oh, they just went back. Like you see open yeah. micers, yeah. the same open micers. And uh, so they're all like, oh, your first time. <laughs> oh, okay, this is good. Get this one under your belt. You know, by your, this is my ninth, or whatever, you know. One day you'll be good, or whatever the fuck. Whatever it was. Anyway, cut to I'm the only guy that passed. Oh. That night. That night. And ba That's and so you nice. had the the joke you had the one Brett good joke. Brett Butler had passed the week before me. Rest in peace. I'm kidding. No, she's, uh, she's no, alive, she's right? Alive. She's alive, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh, she was great. She yeah, was great. she was funny. She was like my bud. Um, uh, the uh, and you had here comes the neighborhood, right? Maybe yeah, maybe I got it that night. Yeah, I think I did have it that night. You you have you. What were you talking about? Just no recollection. I said some bad joke about Miles Davis is so black, lightning bugs follow him in the daytime. <laughs> and That's funny. I don't know, maybe two more minutes of jokes. Right. And I kind of killed. Yeah. And did you feel like, <laughs> oh shit, were you like, I shouldn't be killing or like, this is easy? It was more like, this is easy. It wasn't like, I shouldn't be killing. Um, you know, my ego like, is, what's the big deal? What's the big deal? This comedy thing. Why are people thing? waiting for Eddie Murphy? When? And I proceeded to kill for about three weeks. Yeah. So my first three weeks, I'm annihilating. Wow. I'm killing to the point they're like, oh, think about bringing in the SNL people to see you. Like my first year, right? And I brought a girl. I had That'll a girlfriend back then. I know how this uh -oh. story goes. Uh -oh. And I brought Kim, and I proceeded to bomb for the next three years. <gasps> no. <laughs> yeah, that's what happened. I proceeded to, it was, it took me three years to even get back to that point. <laughs> what do you think it was? Just one of them you, things? You know, it's that thing, that confidence and arrogance. Once yeah. you get that, like the comedian yeah. can't get to that arrogant place. Yeah. Gotta be confident. But once you cross that line, yeah, it's like fuck you. Yeah, is and it that the failure you just that like threw you off? The well, I was probably too cocky up to. First oh. of all, I was young as fuck, you know, and I what looked were you, young. Nineteen twenty. It's like nineteen twenty, and I look, oh, yeah, but so I looked like, like 
13. Yeah. I mean, I, was, I, I weighed like 130 pounds or something. <laughs> All, you couldn't find clothes that fit. Yeah, like, like, like I was... Any that, picture of you before 1990, nothing fits. Yeah, I was, Everything is too big. I was so skinny, right? Um, so I really... You know, a lot of stand-up is... You know, th there's a reason there's no Justin Bieber of comedy. Yeah. There's no little way. Like, Eddie Murphy is the closest thing we've ever had to a young comedian. And all the rest of them are 30 years old. Right. Yeah. <laughs> to yeah. start. Yeah. <laughs> there's Before one young guy. That. One guy that was 22 and fucking ripped it. But all the rest of them are kind of grown men and women. And so I was young, and one and part of the reason is just no one believes you when you're that young. Yeah, you know what I mean. There's no point of view. There's no. Like, is, you have no point of view. Dating, it's like it's like what do you know? Yeah. What the fuck do you know, kid? Yeah. Shut the fuck up. But they'll take Miles Davis being black. Yeah, yeah. You they'll, don't they'll, need to. Any any age can see that. Yeah. Take your your silly shit. How you feel?